Hey, Reen. Thanks for inviting me out tonight. I just thought I'd never get a chance to spend time with you like this again. I mean, sure, it would have been nice to be here under better circumstances, but despite everything going on in the world, I still enjoyed our time tonight. Every last moment of it. So, thank you. I mean it. Right. Hand in hand. Mm, what a wonderful breeze. <laughs> wow, this is an amazing view. I can see Michelam, the Pantagruel, and even Crossbell City. Bringing me here to sober up. My, you really know how to show a girl a good time. <laughs> oh, it's nothing like that. I simply got the idea when we landed here this evening. More to the point, I had anticipated your inevitable inebriation, my dear Shara. <laughs> you really do know me. This is nice. I miss those days when we were able to share drinks together. But you've been doing a fantastic job ever since coming back to the Empire. Though they call you debaucherous prince, you never let it get to you. You've been there for your family. Hell, the whole Empire. Well, I've never been without people supporting me. Mueller, my parents, Alfin, Class 7, the Viscount, the Erebonian Bracers. I can't forget Lloyd's team, and, of course, Estelle and Joshua. But most of all, you. No, I couldn't do a thing to help you. Sure. I held on to the artifact for you and acted as a liaison, but I couldn't stop the Courageous from being destroyed. I couldn't keep you safe. I'm sorry, Olivier. I'm sorry that I wasn't there for you. It must have been painful. You've suffered so much. Now that you're here, all that pain is but a distant memory. We'll be there tomorrow. Together. That's all that matters. But... No, you're right. Just leave it to me. The Silver Streak will light the way for your radiant wings. I'll be counting on it. And it may not be fair to ask you at a time like this, yet. Uh? If we can claim victory in tomorrow's battle and stop the Great Twilight, if we can put out the fires of war and bring peace to this land once more, would you do me the honor of becoming my wife?
mean? I'm sorry. Oh, oh no, that's not what I meant. I'm sorry for all the trouble I've caused you. When all you've done is your best. And I'm only realizing now how stupid I've been acting this whole time. Reen? Wait. Please, let me say it first. This time, for real. I'm going to be brave, so please. I love you. Maybe it's not fair after I was so wishy-washy about my feelings. But I can't give you up. I just can't. I want you, Reen. Here. With me. It's so beautiful. Reen, I'd like to stay with you tonight. Would that be okay? <laughs> 